Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews and today I've got another episode of Classic Candy Corner. Found these online at Old Time Candy and I, honestly this one, one that I have no no clue, I don't really remember it. I might have saw it somewhere in the past but I don't think I've ever had one of these to tell you the truth so I'm gonna Go ahead and give it a try. First time for you guys. It is a classic. I know it's been around. I, I have never seen these in the stores since when I was little, but I know this is like an old time one. And if you had some kind of big event in your life and you want to have a, want to share it with everybody, you'd go out and sell, tell them the good news. Yeah, good news bar. I don't know anything about it. It is a to celebrate rich milk chocolate peanuts and caramel so maybe this is going to be like a baby ruth or, or a snickers or something it's by christopher's and i don't know probably have to do a little bit of research but i think you know because it's the old time kind of candy bar uh, it's been around so here we go let's try for you guys um, and for me since I've never had it before uh, this is kind of the old time Kenny Clark bars uh, Fifth Avenue Baby Ruth uh, Milky Way Snickers kind of along those lines all right here's what it looks like I'm gonna go ahead and take a bite <laughs> hopefully pretty good so here we go wow <laughs> it is like a snickers without the nougat very rich dense caramel wow yeah <laughs> rich milk chocolate wow Caramel's like a big chunk. Very dense. I could taste that milk chocolate too. So yeah, it's almost like a Snickers, but with no nougat. It's like half a Snickers. Remember they would say, or well, commercial with Snickers, any way you slice it, it comes up peanuts. Well, no, it's not true. took the snicker bar and you cut it in half peanuts and caramel on top and you get on the bottom no peanuts <laughs> so yeah top half of a snicker bar very dense on that caramel chocolate's okay not a big lot a lot of coating on this one I said, we're almost like a Baby Ruth, but the, the caramel's a little bit more dense on this one. But, I know this had to be from like the 50s or the 60s. Like I said, with the Clark Bar, Fifth Avenue Uno. Um, what was the other one? The Zero Bar. Some of them surface here and there. But... Yeah, this is along with your old time candy, classic candy bars, and I don't know. Oh, they also had yeah, another one was called Look, and it was um, nougat with chocolate on it. So that one was kind of along the same line. I think it was probably the similar to that one. Um, maybe it could it could have this could have been like a regional thing never know but certainly it is pretty good and it is uh, interesting to go back and try some of the old time candies especially the ones you haven't actually tried <laughs> maybe some of them maybe you remember these maybe you don't go ahead and leave a comment down below maybe if you remember having these also they have some that different regions have them or different um areas there was another one I remember. 
to remember, it's called Powerhouse Bar. I think it was something like that. But it's one, one of those little kind of obscure things that uh, you don't always see, but they're out there. I'm truly classic. So um, if you could find them, if you have, are lucky enough to have them in your, you know, grocery store or um, convenience store sometimes have them. Mom and pop shops sometimes do get them, liquor stores. Um, sometimes they carry some of the old ones, I don't know. The uh, vendors come to them and say, hey, would you like to carry this? Um, see if you could find them, pick them up. Also, like I said, there are so, still some of the ones, oh, Henry, um, yeah, Baby Ruth, Milky Way, Snickers, um, all the other ones, um, Munch Bars, <laughs> anything that, uh, Payday, that was the other one, Chocolate Payday, that's what kind of reminds me of a little bit, but that was a lot more um, peanuts and not as much caramel. But yeah, definitely go out, give it a try if you can find it. Also, maybe, you know, look for a little bit of the old time classics that they had. Um, kind of go back and remember when you were a little kid some of the things you used to get mostly chocolate bars I know everybody had their favorite and um, yeah so um, kind of the memory of this one and like I said it was kind of one of those obscure things that uh, probably was out there and I don't really remember don't really remember this one but doesn't mean I didn't have it I just maybe don't remember having it so there you go, guys. A little memory of a kind of a little obscure good news bar. And um, yeah, a little bit of trying it for the first time. So that's always interesting. Like I said, going back and trying it or going back and trying something that you haven't had for a long time. Now, like some of these candies that I've been trying, the classic ones, I haven't had them, you know. <laughs> probably 40 50 years and um you know they're still around some of them you can find a little bit of obscurity some of them also they'll bring them back you know after um popular demand they discontinued them and then the people say you know i love this candy bar i love this candy please bring it back and then they'll bring it back or another company takes over and says hey we're gonna bring back this one there are a few that got discontinued from some of them, and I wish they really would bring them back. Maybe I'll have to write to the companies and ask them, could they please bring them back? But you never know. Reggie Bar, Flix, uh, just to name a few. So there you go, guys. Um, a little bit of fun with an old-time classic that I don't really remember. So there you go. So if you liked the video... Give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell over here. That way you won't miss any future content. Or if I go live, you won't miss the fun. So until next time, Drew's Food Reviews. I'll be trying another classic candy for you. And uh, hopefully finding something very interesting too. So until next time, guys, I'll talk to you later.